What's up YouTube? On this video my friend over at Megadon's Gaming has come up with a method to stop the Noglin use its mind control trick on your character. Now for PvP this is an amazing trick. I mean there's so many bases getting wiped at the moment. The Noglin is so OP that this will help so many people. If you have found this video helpful in any way please go over to a Megadon's Gaming and leave that like on his video and please subscribe. He does put out some great content and as for me I'll see you on my next video. Welcome to Omegadon's Gaming. In this video, after the process of doing several different things or trying different things, I think I finally figured out a way to keep the Noglin from being able to take control of you. Now, this is on my Nitrado server, and this has got PvP settings. Uh, and I'm trying this on wild Noglins. I imagine this should work on ones tamed to be sent after you as well. Um, took myself out of creative, but I did spawn them in over here. Uh, just to give this a try and as you can see I got them blocked off on both ends get these guys separated a little bit uh, as you can see now being taken control I hate these guys with a passion even on the PvE servers that I play on official I hate them hate them hate them hate them and I've been working to try to find a way to prevent these little guys from being able to do this shit uh, to you and the method is actually quite simple uh, it's kind of like Ark brought back a forgotten uh, remedy uh, to do this so I'm gonna let my timer run out again I'm gonna show you guys this isn't a fluke and I've not edited this video intentionally to show that there's no been no edits no piecing no nothing uh, no falsehoods anything like that so you can see straight up raw unedited footage so you will have to sit through some of it or skip ahead but uh I thought it'd be more prudent to do this video unedited so that way you can see it in its entirety and there's no tricks with uh, editing so <coughs> excuse me I'm under the weather today um, and you see piss it off again make it jump on again see no fluke it is jumping <coughs> it is controlling And I just love this. I've had one on PvE with a, I had a cryo ball in my quick slot in my hand. And then I ended up throwing it out, which had a Giga in it. And it took control of my Giga and attacked my wyverns and killed them. Uh, and some of the dead shots. You, you gotta love these little guys. Turrets don't react to them. Dinos on aggressive don't react to them. Uh, and so on and so forth. So, but believe it or not, there's... Uh, you know the uh, when you used to do the cave runs on the island and center and stuff like that, you get bit by the bat, you had a disease. Uh, so you use a lesser antidote to block it. Well, the lesser antidote actually blocks the noglins as well. And as soon as my timer runs out here, there we go. I'm going to take the lesser antidote. And get on the floor, and I'm not in creative. And as you can see, they attack you physically, but they can't jump on. And they're trying. And I have like 20, 30 Noglins spawned in this little area. Like I said, I was messing around with several different things. Anything. Uh, to uh, the cactus uh, sap or the cactus brew. Anything like that to try. And <laughs> they still jumped on. Uh, tried the velos. Velos don't lock onto them. Turks don't lock onto them. Uh, these guys have been a headache and a thorn in my side. But it looks like Wildcard re kind of like revamped uh, an old method of keeping, you know, diseases. I mean, with the lesser antidote, which, you know, most people don't usually use in the caves anymore because usually characters are high enough level and they keep enough med brews and things on them that they can survive having rabies uh, with the butts. You see, I'll jump down again. They're trying, but they cannot latch on. The only thing they can do is physically attack you. Finally, something that these little buttheads effectively blocks them. Now, 
just doesn't block your dinos because dinos, of course, you can't take the lesser antidote. I'm still trying to find a, a method that allows the dinos to block from being taken over. Uh, and I've been unsuccessful uh, as of yet. If you guys have figured anything out, you know, leave, leave uh, some uh, comments in the comment section and we'll give it a test. Uh, and if you guys uh, liked this kind of stuff, please like and subscribe to my channel. Uh, notifications even if you haven't subscribed to my channel leave a comment if you got another idea or a suggestion to try to experiment with uh, I do like doing these videos uh, especially if a subscriber comes up and says hey can you try this or try this I, I love going and trying this stuff out and seeing how this works I'm hoping this will help on the PvP side of things because it's like it's like they're unstoppable as far as being able to control another person uh, like I said, again, I haven't figured out the dino aspect of being able to stop them. Again, if you guys have figured it out or somebody's figured it out, let me know in the comment section and I'll, uh, I'll post a video on it, uh, trying your method out. And of course, I always give credit to the people out there who have asked for me to try this or if somebody else has put a video out and uh, I like the concept of, I do give them a shout out as well. We're going to let the... the uh, antidote run out again just to show you that it was the antidote that's actually blocking it then I'll jump down and I will be taking control of again as you can see I hope this method helps uh, and again as I always say have a great day and happy arcing everybody be safe especially in times like this